Set wasn't long enough. Be looking forward to a longer set. I'm almost going to be doing the whole record, so look forward to that. Very informative, very inquisitive from a very mysterious man. But we have one last burning question for my friend, Boondocks. Boondocks, what hand do you wipe your butt with? That would be my right hand. See, myself, I use toilet paper. Thank you for your time, Boondocks. Hope to see you on Halloween. Thank you, guy. Coming soon, Jamie Madrox, Monoxide, Twisted, Independence Day. Featuring today's top independent superstars, Master P, The Dog Pound, DJ Quick, Head P.E., Rehab, The Dayton Family, Independence Day coming to a record retailer soon near you. Don't miss it. Twisted. Juggalos and Juggalettes. It's time for the Chronicles of the Dark Carnival. Three short films directed by Roy Soda and written by Jump Steady and Violent J. Hosted by Shaggy Too Dope and Violent J. ICP. Chronicles of the Dark Carnival. Coming soon on DVD to a store near you and hatchetgear.com. Hey, are those new specs? Uh, you know, I um, like to wake up my face with sexy specs. All right, we've got a lot of news for you in the world of sports. Boy, do we ever. And there's only one man that can tell it to you the way it needs to be told, and I'm talking about the dick. Big Dick Martindale! All right, fellas, let's jump right into it. Big Dick Martindale right here, giving you all the news on what's happening in the sports world right here, Hatchet Action News. Strangle Mania, that's right. The long-awaited Strangle Mania Collector's Edition, Strangle Manias 1 and 2, are going to be available on DVD for the very first time ever. And there will be some bonus material. And it just so happens that I got my hands on a little bit of that bonus material. And let's take a quick look at that right now. And here comes Big Blossom. Big Mike Blossom off the top rope. Oh, eight feet off the top rope. Oh, Holy shit. Sh oh, right there. Nice. Oh, and face ginger. in the muff. She took Oh, fuck. Yeah, Juggalos, that's going to be some hot shit right there. Coming out on October 27th through Psychopathic Sports, right on hatchetgear.com and at stores near you. Now, on November the 17th, Huntington, West Virginia, the long-awaited feud between Psychopathic and the Midnight Express will come to a head. That's right. It's no secret to the wrestling world that... The Rude Boy and the Insane Clown Posse have had their run-ins with Jim Cornette and the Midnight Express, and it's all going to come to a head. Because on November the 17th, Huntington, West Virginia, it is the Insane Clown Posse and Rude Boy in against Jimmy Cornette and the Midnight Express. That will be one barn burner that you don't want to miss out on seeing Juggalos in the West Virginia area. Get your tickets real soon. We'll have more information on that big show coming up in the next couple weeks right here on Hatchet Action News. Also, Juggalos, I will have a very, very, very special update next week right here on Hatchet Action News regarding ICP's return to wrestling on television. That's right. You know it. They've been everywhere. And you know what? They're returning back to nationwide television real soon. And I'm going to have the inside scoop. I'm not supposed to tell anyone, but I'm going to have it right here. Hatchet Action News next week. It's going to be awesome. Big news. JCW Hardcore Champion Rude Boy returns back to action for a rare swing of Northern California. That's right, where he will be a part of Wrestle Rock 06. Now, what is Wrestle Rock, you may be asking? 
Wrestle Rock is rock music along with wrestling. Thus, Wrestle Rock. Yes, the rock music will be provided by 80s hair bands. That's right, LA Guns, YNT, and a whole slew of others. And the wrestling will be provided by JCW's very own the Head Shrinkers. That's right, Samu and Alofa. They will be in the house, as well as former WWE superstar Zach Gowan. And, you know, he's only got one leg, so he'll be out there hobbling around doing his damn thing, you know? And then, of course, the JCW hardcore champion, Rude Boy, will be in the house. That's going down November 9th in Redding, California. November 10th in Fresno, California. And November 11th in San Francisco, California. Watch out. Be looking for ticket information right here on Hatchet Action News in the upcoming weeks. Remember, for all of your sports needs, look no further than the one and only Big Dick Martindale. Remember, next week, special, special investigative reporting by Big Dick himself on the road with ICP and Wrestling Live. Guys, back to you. Pro Big Dick, you certainly never fell with the good shit, I'll tell you that much. A lot of news there, Dick, a lot of news. Juggalos, don't be scared to tune in next week because we have tons, slews, and lots of more news here on the Hatchet Action News about the after party after the Hollow Wicked Show concert here in Detroit. And that's not it, fuckwads. We're also gonna cue you in on what the dealio is on ICP's return to the squared circle. And don't forget, Insane Clown Posse will be invading New York for the CMJ Music Convention. That shit and many more. All of those goods and a lot more next week on the Weekly Freakly Weekly. I'm Fat, and I'm Fats Pepper. Hey, and I'm Guy, and I'm Guy Gorfee. And for Dick, Big Dick Martindale, this is Hatchet Action News, slapping the news upside your bitch ass. <laughs> Fellas. Yes. I have a problem I want to see if you have the same thing. Crabs in your beard? Close, but not quite. I've been using Epilady lately on my bikini area. Ooh, bikini burn. No, more like festering boils. Ooh. Whoa. I've tried the Nair and I get a wax. Ouch. Nair was no good. I get a wax, it. but I get a rash. Ouch. I'm scared one of my balls might have to be removed. Could it be your, uh, your perm is too tight? It could be the vagina under my nuts. I don't know, but I do have an appointment with my physician on Tuesday. I'd like it if you guys would be there for support. Tuesday? Yeah. Lunch in. I'm busy Tuesday. Uh, I was with you on we that We got day. that thing to do Tuesday. Well, I guess I'll stick with Epilady.